in a rental car slam on the brakes. I was like this far back from the car in front of me. Why am I going into a Walgreens parking lot? This is not where I need to go. What the fuck, man? Like, where am I going? Stupid goddamn GPS always fucking me, man. Definitely said, at the traffic light, make a left. I'm like, all right. That looks like it used to be a no turn on red, but it's blank now. Hello world, and welcome to another one. We're going on a brief little adventure this evening. I was thinking it'd be a good test, real test for the heated gloves, but I put them on and I'm not turning them on yet. We're gonna see how that is first, I guess. We've got about a 30 minute ride ahead of us. No craziness tonight. Might be a boring one, might be an exciting one. But these are the kind of adventures that I really look forward to on the bike. I just got out of work. I'm gonna go see some friends over in uh, New Haven. The city. Ah, uh, the city. We're gonna turn the heating gloves on. Give it, give it a whirl here. I think it's supposed to be like 38 degrees out, um, 37, 38 or something like that. Let's do a quick rundown of the setup this evening. Um, I almost wish that I had better socks. I just have like some Nike dry fit mid calves. We'll do this from the, from the bottom up. So, that's the sock situation. We got some boots on. Boots. Legging wise, pant wise, we've got like a pair of, uh, I mean I guess they're technically sweatpants, but they're like, you know, thin uh, at the ankle joggers. Very, very nice to slip on some riding pants above, on top of, around. Um, I kind of dig the little purple coloring on my mirrors from my, from my glove lights. Um, underwear, obviously, of course. Um, but then the, uh, the torso is where it really gets interesting, I guess. We've got, uh, a thin slash tight long sleeve t-shirt that was comma t-shirt another long sleeve a sweatshirt a hoodie and then my jacket that's the torso I have a new banna I usually wear uh, well the same banna neck gaiter thing. I think neck gaiter is a, a more common terminology for them. But I will never forget the little cardboard thingy that came with it called it a banna. So I call it a banna. Um, I got like a thicker wool one for Christmas from my fiance. So I figured what better day to try that when I'm going out riding than a sub 40 day. And we've got some earplugs. I think uh, I think I'm rocking the eargasm earplugs. Um, gloves are the Iron Gia's heated gloves. Recommended directly from the man himself, Ducati NYC. And then we got a nice little uh, rock helmet. The 
or the 4.0er. Also, I'm taking it a little bit easy because uh, it felt damper. I mean, it, it didn't obviously didn't rain. The sun has gone down since I was out, um, whatever it was, five hours ago or something like that. Um, so I'm just I'm trying to assess the road conditions. I took a little gander as I got moving. Um, no crazy, no crazy turns. Okay, none of that. The last time I went to New Haven and back was also at night and it rained on the way back it's like 11 o'clock at night or something like that these gloves are meaty meaty indeed Thought they were gonna run it. I love this banner already. I can say, well done, fans. I approve. I'll tell her when I get there. She's there already at her friends. <clears throat> That's why I'm riding the bike. I took the car, and I wouldn't have gone if it wasn't for the uh, heated gloves or the FOMO. I can't believe I got a green arrow. Sorry guys. Now I'm gonna watch out for all these people potentially jumping into my open lane. But I think they're gonna take a right up here and that's why they're all sitting tolerating that. But I'm gonna sit here and listen to my GPS. Because I think it's gonna tell me to turn right too. Maybe not. Motherfucker, they're putting me on the merit. Should have known. Did not think we were going to get on the Merit. speed limit on this highway and everybody here is fucking gapping me. Just shows you how crazy this highway is. Who would have ever thought that the motorcyclist was the same one? You know? Bye bro. My earpiece or my earplug just morphed itself out of my ear a little bit and that felt really weird and uncomfortable and I didn't like it. 
pretty sure my exit's coming up. And there's a cop here. Hi, cop. First time I've seen a cop on the Merit in a while. So funny that I got passed by a cop while doing like 70 on a highway that's 55. And everybody else is just going by. accident on this tunnel I had some uh, some Chinese guys who barely spoke any English uh, in a rental car slam on the brakes I was trying to gap it I was like this far back from the car in front of me and they just slammed on him dude wasn't a bad accident at all, really. Um, and the funny thing about it was like, I pulled over right back here where I just passed, I'm talking to them. I'm like, you guys all right? They're like, yeah. They're like, it's a rental car. I'm like, all right, well, I'm gonna call the cops. Um, hang on, I wanna hear where I'm going. Um, so I tell them I'm gonna call the cops, blah, 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 you know, I'm doing the right thing. I hit them. Didn't know why they stopped, but obviously, you know, I'm the following car, it's my job. You know, there's a Lamborghini over there. Cool. So, I tell them I'm going to go call the cops, and we're going to sit in our respective cars. I call the cops, finish doing my thing. This guy's inching like he wants to take a right. And, um, I, like, text my fiancé, girlfriend at the time. I'm like, hey, I just got in an accident, I'm okay, blah, blah, blah. I look up, they drove off. shows up he's like what do you want to do I'm like I don't know what happens he's like he's like well you can file a police report but I don't know why you'd want to do that if you hit him I'm like yeah I don't want to do that he goes all right why am I going into a Walgreens parking lot this is not where I need to go I can't take a left turn, can I? But I'm gonna fucking do it. Stupid goddamn GPS always fucking me, man. Stupid bullshit, I'll tell you. Definitely said, at the traffic light, make a left. I'm like, alright. My insurance went up from that accident. That looks like it used to be a no turn on red, but it's blank now. Not a bad ride at all. You know, you always like, I'm plucking up the courage. Is this guy going through? 
Jesus, like, he wanted it. Um, he's in a rush, it would seem. So, you're always, like, plucking up the, not plucking up the courage, but, like, you're, like, aware of the dangers of going riding at night. Especially on the highway, or if you thought I was going to get on the highway, I wasn't sure the route was going to take me. It's been different every time. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you on the return.